Hi everybody and welcome back to IPEX Training. I'm Coach Rachel and today we have a 45 minute interval run for you. I hope you guys are ready to get sweaty, but if you miss any speed or incline changes, I don't want you to worry because we're gonna have all that displayed for you to see on your screen right over here. And then if you look over onto the opposite side, you're gonna see this nice long progression bar and that's gonna show you where we are from start to finish through this whole entire workout. So make sure you have a water bottle and a towel handy. And if you are ready to get sweaty, let's look down at that tread. Let's hit that start button in three, in two, and one. Here we go. We start two, five, three, five. Start warming it up. All right. Start moving and grooving today. So 45 minute intervals. We have three different blocks. Okay. Each block has six different intervals in it. Okay. So we're going to do some math. All intervals are a little bit different. Each block is a little bit something new. Okay. So the first one's going to be a hard run. Second one's going to be a long run. And the third block is going to be some sprints. Okay. So let's start warming up the body, rolling the shoulders down and back, breathing in and out through your nose, maybe rolling them forward. I know it always looks silly when you roll the shoulders forward, but shake it out. From here, we go into an incline jog. So we'll take it up to a two and start off slow, right? It's a two minute incline jog. You don't have to go jump right out the gate and have it be your fastest speed, okay? Take your time, warm your body up. All right, give me two on the incline. And now we go four, five, six, five. So start picking it up. Again, don't have to start in a sprint. You don't have to start in a hard jog. Just start making it a soft jog, right? What's a jog? One foot off the ground, one foot on the ground at all times. All right, so shake out those arms one more time. After this, two minutes here on this incline. We can keep the pace the same. We'll kind of speed it up just a little bit more. One more minute, flat road, jog it out, and then we'll go right into our intervals. Every interval has a recovery. Okay, each block is a little bit different. The recovery times, because each block work time is a little bit different. All right, remember what I always say. It's like those first couple of minutes, you start moving, it's like harder to breathe. That's okay. Let it go, we have one more minute. I'm gonna pick up my pace just a little bit more. All right. Okay. I see where I messed up already. So the first <laughs> interval, there's no walk and recovery. I didn't even say that. The recovery, so I didn't even really, didn't even really mess up. I just kind of gave you the impression that you had a walk and recovery. There's no walking. It's a soft jog. Soft jog, hard run. Soft jog, hard run. You get it. Six times in a row. So 30 seconds. We take down the incline. We're at a four, five, seven, four, five, six, five here. We'll take it to a four, five, seven, oh, and 20. Shake it out, shake it out. Good, 15 seconds. Keep working, keep working. 10, nine, eight, five, four, three, two, incline comes down. It's the only time we incline so far. Speed comes up a little bit. Four, five, seven, oh. All right, from here, we go. Interval run for a minute. Hard run for 30 seconds. That's it. Six times in a row. Our interval run, five, oh, eight, oh. Our hard run, six, oh, 10, oh. We go in 30. All right? Five, oh, eight, oh in 30 seconds. Yep, I know. You're like, wait a second. We only walk for the first minute, yes. Yes. We're running it out, okay? Give me 14 minutes, right? The first 14 minutes, let's go hard. You get a one minute walk and recovery right off of that. 5080, three, two, one. Go pick it up. One minute here. 30 seconds, we pick it up even harder. It's gonna go by pretty fast. I promise. I promise you that. Whew, squeeze that core, pump the arms. It's all work right here. There's no break. There's no time to doubt. There's no time to stop, okay? Whew. 
And the first hard run, yeah, it's gonna be hard. Maybe the first two. Your body's gonna slowly start warming up to it though. Okay, so be nice to yourself. Don't beat yourself up. It's gonna have a moment where it all starts to click together. 20 seconds, we go. 6-0, 10-0. Come on, come on, come on. In 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, six, oh, ten, oh. It's only 30 seconds here. Stay focused. Stay hungry for it. Pump those arms. Squeeze that core. Move those legs. 10 down. 20 to go. Stay with me. You got it. Right, it's a hard run. It's not a sprint. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, five, oh, eight, oh. One minute. Turn this off, jog into your recovery moment, okay? Let's go, let's go. Squeeze that core. See, I told you, first one, you're gonna feel. Second one. Gonna open the lungs. The third through six, I'm gonna rock it out. I promise. <sighs> How are you feeling? You're like, well, not well, Rachel. We just started running. <laughs> six minutes right off the bat. Yeah, you love it though. 30 seconds. Last 20. The paces stay the same, so there's no, uh, no guessing what's coming next, okay? Just six rounds. We go 6-0, 10-0, and eight. Get ready to pick up that pace. Five, four, three, two. Pick it up, pick it up. 6-0, 10-0, run it out. Even harder, ha. Whew. Squeeze that core. Pump those arms. Whew. Don't forget to smile. Come on, team. Guess what? You only have 10, 8, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, good, 5 oh, 8 oh. Beginning of interval number 3 already right here, right? After this one, you're already halfway through the first block. This one is just like the kickstarting block, right? That's what I call it. It's like the shock your body. Shock your body block. Because this one we work hard because we don't stop running, okay? The second one, they're all hard for different reasons. Just want to put that out there. The second one, we run longer. You get a walking minute recovery in between it, though. Minute. We're only 30 seconds. Not even 30 seconds of recovery. 30 seconds, we work harder here. Get ready. 15 seconds, we take it back up. 6 0 10 0. You ready? Oh, yeah. 10, 8, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2. Take it up, take it up. 6 0 10 0. Hard. Hard run number three. I said it in birth at the same time. Sorry, guys. Let's go. 20 seconds. Let's go. 15. Get ready. 5 0, 8 0, 1 minute, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2. We're still moving. It's not a break yet. Keep that body in movement. Whoa, 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 whoa. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Ha! This is block number four. I mean, block number four. Interval number four. Come on, mouth. E me, 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 me. Get it together. Let's go. I did this. My elbow hit the button. I slowed down my pace. Oh, yeah. I'll stick for time, okay? My numbers need to be correct. Come correct, Rachel. Little big ass elbows of yours. 20 seconds. We go again. Our 30 second hard push. Now you don't have to just stay at the same number. It's 6 0 10 0. You need to pick it up? Pick it up. We're holding you back. All right? We go. In six, 
five, four, three, two, six, so ten, oh, 30 seconds. Keep squeezing, keep working, keep pushing. Breathe, let it out. 20 seconds. Come on, come on, come on, come on. You only have 10 seconds left. You only have 10 seconds left. Get ready. 5080 in four, three, two. All right, take it back down. One minute. Keep it up, keep it up, keep it up. You're okay. All right? We're starting interval number five. Two more left in this round. About three more minutes, then your one minute recovery, okay? You got it. It's light work. Light work. We just running. We're just moving. 30 seconds. See, it's not so bad, right? Because this little pace right here, this interval, the run pace, it starts to bring it back in, right? Feel a little bit more calm. That's good. That means it's working. 10 seconds. 6, oh, 10, oh, pick it up if you can. 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2. Pick it up, 30 seconds. 6, oh, 10, oh. What a difference, right? When your lungs open up. You feel like you can breathe no matter at what pace you can go at. Oh, that's the magic. You got 10 seconds. We take it back down. 5080 and five, four, three, two. Take it back down. 5080. It's the last one. One minute run, 30 second hard run. Then you get your minute recovery. If you are new to running, and this is the longest period of time you've ran without stopping, I just want you to give yourself a pat on the back, pat on the back, pat on the back, okay? Give yourself a pat on the back, but you're not done yet, okay? Got a little bit more, a little bit more to go. Yep, we're a third of the way in. 20 seconds, last hard run, and we get to walk it out. 20 seconds, we go, 6.0, 10 If you can, add out point 0.1, point 0.2. What's the worst that's gonna happen? All right, you're gonna need to slow down your pace. It's only 30 seconds, you got this. We go, in five, four, three, two, 6.0, 10 30 seconds. Squeeze the core, pump the arms. We get to walk on the other side of this, 3.0. 4-0, you get a one minute recovery, and you get to feel that in 10, in eight, in six, five, four, three, two, three, oh, four, oh. You earn this, okay? 13 minutes, basically 12 minutes of running because only the first minute we were walking. 12 minutes straight, right? Should be over a mile depending on your run pace. But if you stayed at the paces that we are suggested, it's definitely over a mile. So imagine that. It's like your warm up, you just warmed up with a mile, huh? All right, second round. There are two and a half minute intervals, 5.080. So we're at that run pace we were already at. We've already been there. Nothing new, nothing new with the paces. Now we just hold it for longer. You have two and a half minutes we run. One minute walk and recovery. 3040 at this pace, okay? So you don't have to run fast, you just have to hold the pace. I told you, we already made it our comfort zone. Let's go back. Let's run, right? Maybe every one we add on point one. Let's go in three, two, one. Give me 5080. 5080. Maybe every run, every two and a half minute burst, we add on point one, okay? Two and a half minutes is definitely not one minute though. So make sure you pick yourself accordingly. If you are struggling, struggling through the first round, okay? Stay on the lower end. You don't have to 
increase your pace every run or every interval. You don't have to. It's an option. Choose to try to push forward though, okay? But if it's really stressful and you're struggling just to finish, finishing is the game, okay? Finishing is what you need to do. I like to set myself up for success. Yeah, I don't try to overdo something. I know I'm not gonna complete. To me, not completing the task at hand messes with my head. So if I have to give 80% to finish, I'd rather give 80% to finish than give up. 90 seconds. See, the pace is nice. You're really gonna enjoy. This is the longest portion, right? This is the longest block. We're gonna spend most of our time here. So I just want you not to waste it either, right? I know I said you can keep it on the low side, but just you have to eat, you have to know that there is a balance, right? You have to know what your limitations are, and you have to know when you're holding yourself back. Those two are completely different, okay? So you just gotta listen to your intuition. <laughs> Don't ask why I sang it, but I nailed it. Listen to the one. Fight for it, okay? You can always bring the pace back down. Whew. Guess what? 40 seconds left. I know. Two and a half minutes in your comfort zone pace. We're going to try to get out of the comfort zone. If you feel like this is it, though. Right? We're running to make some magic happen. To make some change happen in our body. How are you gonna, how are you gonna change your body? You have to change the things you do. Yeah, it's so simple, right? You want change, do change. Be change. You don't want the results, do, the, do nothing, do the same. Here we go, five, four, three, two, three, oh, four, oh. Okay, we're taking them back down. The whole minute to recover here. Hydrate, towel off, whatever you need to do. We're gonna do it again though, okay? The last block is quick. So like I said, we spent the majority of our time here. So I don't want you to waste those two and a half minutes. Don't want you to take it easy just because they're longer runs, right? I want you to really try to push out of your comfort zone. So if you could, like I said, add on point one, point two, you're really not gonna notice through the body. It's a mental thing right there. But we'll slowly start to try to increase our pace so that our 5-0 or our 8-0 or whatever we started at, wherever our first round interval run was at, we now make a new pace, that comfort zone, right? We'll make it like easier to run in those faster paces. How do we do that? Keep increasing the pace. We go in three, two, one, let's go. 5-0, 8-0, right? So if I'm slowly increasing, say I'm like half five, five minutes and every minute I'm increasing by the time I got to my fastest pace I went back to my slowest pace that slowest pace should feel like a dream right piece of cake that's what we're looking for the slow build up so when we come back we're like oh my god this is easy I like the challenging part but then the challenging part right we increase from there and now that becomes your easy that's how we grow I don't know. We're doing things here. Keep it up, keep it up, keep it up, keep it up. Come on. We're almost halfway through. Almost halfway through. Interval number two. Let's go team. 90 seconds. One and some miles today. That's it. That's it, get sweaty. Getting them gains. Whew. Whew. Run and flex at the same time. Show everybody we mean business here. Whew. Keep it up, keep it up, keep it up. All right, coming up. Last 30 seconds already. I know, I know. Anything under three minutes is easy. That's I, my personal opinion. Anything over. And you start to think. And thinking is the problem most of the time, okay? 15 seconds. We get to walk it out. 3 oh, 4 oh, in 10, in 8, in 6, 
five, four, three, two, one. There we go. Now walk it out, we'll walk it out. <sighs> Round three, interval number three. We're already almost halfway through block number two. 20 minutes into this workout, so 45 minute workout. Like I said, this block pretty much fills up majority of the time. By the time we finish block number two, there's only 10 minutes left of the workout. Okay, so like I said, don't take it easy here. This is the moment we put in the work, okay? So start adding on more. Say so punch the treadmill. Whoa. All right, 20 seconds, 5080. Try to increase your pace. My newer runners, just try to hold it out for two and a half minutes, right? Ready? In eight, seven. Oh, pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. Oh no, I overshot it. Let's go. Oh, look at that. You got a little bit of a break, okay? Hopefully you listen to the screen, not to me. Let's run, let's run, let's run, let's run. You got it, guys. Oh. <laughs> no, I made you guys run earlier. <laughs> I knew I did it right. Whatever. Okay? Just keep running. You get another break out the other side. I told you, anything over three minutes. So if we ran for three minutes, it's only an extra 30 seconds. We got this. We love running. Love it, love it, love it, love it, love. I love changing my body. I love doing things I didn't think I could do. See? Power positivity. Pick it up. Pick it up. I'm a monster. Okay? Made you run for extra 30 seconds. Hit me now. Love me later. Okay? When you pull up your shirt, you know what that's from? You know what that's expect from? Those extra 30 seconds. Ready to go? Ready to go? Got you guys. Always thinking what's best for you, you know? <laughs> figure it up, figure it up, figure it up, figure it up. Guess what? You only have 90 seconds left, and I really will let you walk a whole entire minute after that, okay? Squeeze that core, pump those arms, in through your nose, out through your mouth. Good. Land nice and soft, ball through your feet. Try not to land onto the heels, right? Good. And focus on your breath. Bring your awareness back to your breath. Running is all about breathing. If you can control your breath, you can, I promise you can run for a lot longer than you think you can. 60 seconds left. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. You only have three more of these long ones. That's five. That's seven minutes. Okay, I did some math in my head. You only have, if we're talking about run times, 10 whole minutes of actual running left. Now when you think about it, it's a 45 minute workout. We're 23 minutes in. Only 10 of those minutes are hard, hard work. You can do it. See how I'm breaking it up for you so it's easier to understand. Easier, easier goal to try to accomplish, why? Cause you're not in your head about it. You're like, okay, 10 minutes I can handle. If I said 25 minutes, maybe a little stress, eh, 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 danger, danger, start to pop in. It's not like that. Okay, three, two, one, three, oh, four, oh. I think that's why a lot of people start and they quit, right? I put too much effort on the wrong part of a working out. Break it up, right? What is this? What is it? Make the goals ridiculous, right? Reduce it to the ridiculous. Podcast I listen to. Make the goal so easy, it's almost impossible to finish the goal. That's where you start on your journey, right? So it's like every day, I'll wake up, I double knot my shoes. And you do that five days in a row, sounds silly, right? Reduce it to the ridiculous, but every day you make sure you double knot your shoes. Then you're like, oh, I've been doing this. Now, double knot my shoes, drink two glasses of water before I leave to go to work. Boom, you do that. 
easy peasy, things that are not stressful. That's how we start. Let's go, three, two, one. You're like, she's on some other shit today. I am, okay? You just, as you get older, things start to just be a little bit more different. I'll say it again in English. Things start to become different. You think different. Trust me, I want a six pack. I want to wake up sculpted. I also really like these snacks at the end of the day. Life is about balance. <laughs> That's 30 seconds in. Two minutes to go. Okay? We're on interval number four of six. So guess what? Two more after this. How you feel? I'm feeling okay? You got this. Stay focused. Stay strong. Listen to the sound of your feet. Good. Only 90 seconds left. First minute down. Let me know what you think is harder, right? The faster runs or those longer runs? Are you power or are you endurance? There's no wrong answer. I just want to connect. I just want to feel your vibes. Woo! Let's go. You ready? Coming up on that last minute. We're 90 seconds down. 60 seconds to go. Pump it up, pump it up. Ooh, ooh. Ooh, ooh. Let's run, let's run. I know, it makes you happy, right? <sighs> You're almost there. 40 seconds. Then you get a one minute walk and recovery. Good, let it out. Don't hold your breath. Keep it up, keep it up. You're almost there. Just a little bit longer. Don't look down at those numbers, stay here. 15 seconds, you're okay. 10, eight, six, five, four, three, two, three, oh, four, oh. Walk it out, walk it out. All right. I get to flip the page. That means we're almost done, okay? Fold the paper in half, halfway through. We're more than halfway through, okay? <sighs> okay, you ready for the last two? I know. So, two more here. Then we have six sprints. 30 second sprint, 30 second recovery. 30 second sprint, 30 second recovery. 30 seconds left. Hydrate if you need it. Might as well, you know? Shake it all around in there. Ready? Have you been increasing? Check in with yourself, huh? Huh? Have you been taking the easy way? Have you been trying to go for it? Let's go in five, four, three, two. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. By the way, though, let's go. By the time we finish this work, this one, okay, we're 30 minutes into our 45 minute workout. You have one more long one and the rest are short and sweet. Sweet and fast, so sweet and set, uh, sweaty, I wanna say. Sweet and sweaty, but we're ready. Oh. Spin hot fire, okay? Lyrical genius. Somebody give me an album. Best rapper alive. Don't ask me what I just said, I already forgot, okay? <laughs> keep it up, keep it up, keep it up, keep it up. All right, just 90 seconds. Just keep going for it. We've already been here. We know what it feels like. Now you fight to keep it, okay? It's not like you get to the end goal. And then you can just quit. It's constant work, right? Yeah, that's where they get you. But 
It also comes very addicting to kind of constantly push yourself. Do something more, be something better. Run a little harder, run a little longer. You're like, I didn't think today. I was tired, I worked all week, I'm emotionally drained, right? I didn't think I could run these four miles, but I did it. That's it right there, that's what we live for. Those are the moments, right? Don't have to matter to anybody else. Don't matter, it matters to you. Are you proud? Because if you leave here and you're unhappy with your work, you know you need to get back on the tread next time and throw away the doubt. Because that's all that is, right? You probably told yourself, I'm tired. I'm just gonna do bare minimum, which is better than doing nothing, I'm not gonna lie. But you allowed yourself to talk yourself down. You know? You gotta be your biggest hype man. Five, four, three, two, let's go. Three up, four up. I'm, I'm a big stickler for that, being your own hype man. Whew. You can't expect anybody else to know what it is you want, what it is you need. You got to stay accountable for you, right? You want something. You want change. You are the only one that can put in the work. What's that saying that we just saw of good, healthy physique? is something you know can't be bought, can't be borrowed. You have to work for it. It's constant discipline. Constant work, right? For anybody whose genetics are really great or they just are, they got it all and they don't have to do much, you guys are great. For some of us, it is constant work. I feel you. I'm with you. I'm tired. I'm still here. I got two and a half minute run. I'm not going to quit. I'm making it faster than the last one. That's my goal. That's what I told myself I'm going to do. I'm going to complete it. I'm not going to let myself let myself down. Three, two, one. Let's go. You did it. You did it. Not just hold. Right? This is our last one. Our last long one. Keep squeezing that core. After this, the rest of the workout's gonna go like that. It's 30 on, 30 off. By the time you get up to those fast paces, we're already down. Keep going, guys. Casualty, the shoelace, you know? I am not that coordinated to run with a untie shoelace. I'm one of those people, probably step on my own shoelace, and then I'll be like, the Velcro thing on the wall, <coughs> a bug on your windshield, <laughs> on the back of the wall. Yeah, you get them sometimes, you know? It happens sometimes. Let's go, pick it up, pick it up. 90 seconds left, you're one minute down. How's the face feel? Finishable? Is that a word? It is today. Okay. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. We're coming up. Last minute to run. That's it. Everything from here on out is a just a quarter of what we just did. So that math isn't right either, but you know what I'm trying to say. We got it, we got it, we got it. Stay focused, stay hungry. It's my favorite thing to say, stay hungry for it. You do, you gotta want it. There's a moment in every party workout, fatigue sets in, okay? Gotta fight through it. 25 seconds. Maybe you're not feeling it yet. Maybe it's in the sprints. Maybe you felt it in the first block. Maybe it's this moment now. You give me 15 more seconds, you get to walk it out. Your last full minute walk and recovery to the very end though, right? The next six minutes, 30 and 30. We walk it out in three, two, one. Ah, three, oh. 4-0, 4 all right, one minute, I get the chills because I got pee, <laughs> you know, what it feels like all of a sudden you got to pee on the treadmill in the middle of your run, torture, it's like all the hair on the back of your neck stands up, <laughs> Woo! 
you, that's when you breathe it out. I got seven more minutes, eight more minutes, however long this workout is, okay? All right, 30 seconds. It's 6 5 11 0. 6 5 11 0, okay? 6 5 to 11 miles per hour. 30 seconds on, 30 seconds, we take it right back to here. 3 0 4 0. You got this. Piece of cake. Ready? 15 seconds. We take it up already. 10, 8, 5, 4, 3, 2, pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. See? Let's go. Keep it going. Stay strong. That's 10 down already. Only 20 seconds. Keep pumping those arms. Don't lift your chin up too high. Keep looking forward. 10, 8, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 3, 0, 4, 0. 30 seconds. All right. This is round one. Going right into round two. I told you. It's going to be done before you even know it. 20 seconds. The paces can stay the same. Option for you to increase them. Listen, I know. I'm not there. I don't know what your numbers are. You're the only one that's going to know if you're cheating or not. You get to live with that. If you're okay, then, then do it. If not, let's go. Three, two, one. I don't like that mindset in my head. That's just a personal preference. I don't like saying I'm going to do something and then not doing it. It doesn't sit well in my heart and my soul. I say I want to run 6.5 to a 7.5. I'm running 6.5 to a 7.5. I'm not running a 6.4. I'm not like legit. Like that's the level of craziness. Three, two, let's go take it down. Everybody's different though. There's no judgment. But you got, you got to be okay with it, right? You say you're going to do something and then not follow through. You gotta be okay with the decision. All right, we gonna keep following through. That's what we do, okay? 10 seconds, six, five, 11, oh, already. Number three, we going six, five, four, three, two. I'll give me these 30 second sprints all day, every day. You know, cause we're already halfway there. It's like you only have three more 90 seconds of running left. Think about it. Think about it. Think about it. 15 seconds. You're halfway there. 10, 8, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2. Go take it down. 3, 0, 4, 0. Okay, we have sprint 4, sprint 5, sprint 6. You have a one minute uh, recovery and a one minute cool down after that. That's it. Breathe. Let it out. Okay? Let's try to be better than the last one, okay? Even if you feel like the pace is fine, go into it mentally stronger. All right? That 30 seconds doesn't phase you. We go in three, two, one. Pick it up. Six, five, eleven, oh. Six, five, eleven, oh. Keep working. Keep running. Ten down. Smile, guys. Come on, we're halfway there. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 3, 0, 4, 0. Oh, man. This is where I start getting sad because I know the party's going to end soon, okay? <sighs> Got two left. 6, 5, 11, 0. Sprint number five and sprint number six. Piece of cake. Piece of cake. We going 10. <sighs> Come on. Five, four. That was the hype. Three, two. You hyped up. You're ready to sprint. Let's go. 30 seconds. Pick it up. Pick it up. Pick it up. Pick it up. Good. Wider strides. Stronger arm pumps. Bigger inhale. 15 seconds. Keep it going. Go up, flex that core, right? 
Squeeze those muscles. Five, four, three, two, one, three, oh, four, oh. Get ready. Your very last one is on its way. Crescendo at the end. Ready for it? 15 seconds. Let's go fastest. Why not? 30 seconds. Get out of that comfort zone. Get out of your head. Let the legs do the work. We go in seven, six, five, four, three, two. Pick it up. Pick it up. Pick it up. Pick it up. Come on. Six, five, eleven, oh. We're done after this. I mean, we got to recover. But I mean, the work, the hard work. The hard work is after. It's done after. Come on, 10 down. Halfway there. You have 10, 8, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 3, 0, 4, 0. One minute, walk it out, walk it out, walk it out. All right, one minute here. Breathing in and out. <sighs> Letting it all go. You guys, feel incredibly proud of yourself. Okay? This isn't uh, for the week, right? Running is a mental thing. The physical benefits come after. It's you started, it's you against you the whole entire time. You're constantly fighting with yourself, right? Being the voice of reason, telling yourself not to quit when it's so easy to just slow down and stop and just to walk, right? Do you know the amount of power you need to constantly motivate yourself? So give yourself a pat on the back. It is not easy. That's where I started. That's how I started running. I just kept saying, just a little longer, just a little longer. Don't give up just yet. Stay strong, stay focused. Take it down, two, five, three, five. I couldn't even run a mile at one point. Now we can run six, no problem. You know? Started somewhere, I mean, you're talking years of progressing too. Like that's not like overnight, okay? Let me just give you a recap of what we did. We had three different blocks. The first one, one minute, like a hard, uh, we didn't stop, we didn't take a break, okay? We ran for a minute and then we picked up our pace, right? Dipped our toe almost into a sprint, but we made it a hard run. Second block, we had our longer intervals with our minute rest. Third, it's a 30 and 30 sprint on, sprint off, okay? Yeah, we did it, we're doing it. Listen, so once you complete it, do me a favor, okay? Go to the comment section. This is your secret completed emoji for today. It is the islands, yeah baby. No rhyme or reason, we just picked this one because it's cute, okay? Right? Imagine us being there. It's frigid cold in New Jersey. So, we want to be here. Comment this. You see anybody else comment this? Give them a high five. A little bump. Congratulations. One team, one crew. Hit that stop button in three, two, one. This is Ibex Running. I'm Coach Rachel. 45 minute interval run. I'll see you next time.